the harder you work for something, the greater you will feel when you achieve it. With this quotation, I, Shivani, welcome you all to Sins Independence. So let's begin with today's top bus feed. Yogi Adityanath visits Mulayam Yadav to inquire after his health. Uttar Pradesh Chief Minister Yogi Adityanath on Monday paid a visit to veteran politician and Samajwadi Party patriot Mulayam Singh Yadav at his residence on Vikram Aditya Mark to inquire after his health. Mulayam Yadav, who has been admitted to the city's Lohia Medical Institute after a fluctuation in his blood sugar level, was discharged from the hospital at 2 a.m. early on Monday. Receives threat letter offering 1 crore to see Mamta Banerjee dead, claimed Aparupa Podar. Aparupa Podar, Trinamool Congress MP from Arambagh, on Sunday claimed to have got a letter which allegedly says Rs 1 crore will be given to see Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee dead. Later, Podar filed a complaint at the C. Rampur police station. The letter also has a morphed picture of Banerjee in which she is labelled as a witch. The letter has been signed in the name of Rajveer Kila and a mobile number has also been mentioned in it. Two killed in crude bomb attack in Bengal's Kankinara. Two killed and four injured in an explosion in West Bengal's Kankinara in North 24 Parganas district which was rocked by clashes during the recently concluded Lok Sabha elections. Kankinara has been witnessed violence during the Lok Sabha elections last month. Clashes were reported between workers of BJP and Trinamool. Sensex gains over 63 points. IT shares also jumped. Trading on the stock market began firmly on Tuesday due to strong global queues and strong IT stocks. After gaining about 100% in the initial session, the 30-share BSE Sensex was trading at 39,848.3 six points up 63.84 points in the morning similarly the nifty also jumped 11 point to reach the level of 11,933 Shabana Azmi says a nation development is only possible with gender equality veteran actor and activist Shabana Azmi on Monday said that the equal opportunities should be given to both men and women for the nation to progress, the 68-year-old actor spoke in an event about the importance of empowering the weaker sections of the society, citing examples of her social work in her hometown, Mizwan Azamgar. So that's all from today's top stories. Subscribe and press the bell icon to get the latest update. Stay in touch with us to stay in touch with the world. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram.